small town called Pilipolis in the Free State. We are staying at a place called Accommodation Van der Post. Um, there's a lot of history about Van der Post itself um, and I'll get into that a little later. But I thought I'll show you a little place. I can't remember how much I paid for it. <laughs> I'll put it um, like over here. But let me show you what it looks like. The car parked over there. And then as you walk in, there is a bed so it sleeps four people. But I mean, obviously it's only the two of us. Beautiful cupboard. Fan. It's a very cold in here to be honest. The bathroom and shower. And then this is the kitchenette. So it isn't like a burner where you can like cook food on a stove situation so you will either have to buy in town or there is a web outside that we can buy if you want to here is just a little seating area and a little fireplace and then when you go upstairs it's like a loft area yes two other beds as well little desk so it sleeps four people and yeah let me just show you the outside as well so this is the outside And we're gonna be here the entire weekend. What do you think? That's it's weird. In the Klein Dorpi. What's it the The land van Niemans land. This is not really my land or nothing, right? That was nice. The town was nice when you drove in. Wasn't too bad, but there isn't a lot of places to eat. It. So we need to think. They do have a restaurant like right next door, but they said it's not open this weekend. So we're told that this town is very, very safe, so we're gonna walk. Just walk down the road. Like right in front of our property, watching calls, saying hello to people, doing our thing. But we can go and eat at the Philippolis Hotel. There is an, uh, another place down the road, it's called Pit Stop the Restaurant. And the woman that was that walked past us, she was like, Oh, it's so like liquor and vibrant, and the farmers are all there. Um, so we thought we'll go tomorrow, but we'll go and have maybe just a chill vibe at the hotel. But we can nice is that the church is right next to us. Yeah. This is this is our life. It's cold also, so that's our excuse. Yeah, it's really cold. It's very cold. <laughs> and very fancy. T-bone. And a solo with baked potato. Yum yum.
good morning from Philippolis. It is a beautiful day today. The sun is out, so that for me is beautiful. And it is very quiet in the morning. The pump is just going on because you have to switch the pump on and off at this accommodation for water. Um, but for the most part, we are just going to go and have breakfast. We're going to walk down to a restaurant called Pit Stop Restaurant for breakfast. And then I think we're going to come back and then kind of see what the day brings. But this town is very quiet. Um, it is kind of like, I would say in the middle of nowhere, but it's quite a drive to drive in here. And the potholes are atrocious. So that's just something to bear in mind when you do want to come to Philippolis. Oh, and this dog is back. dog right there just keeps barking at me but here's the church it's so pretty and you can hear very quiet there's a river over there as well so yeah still by a stall for that we are just taking a lovely walk to the actual breakfast spot it's very quiet today So right after breakfast, I wasn't feeling too well, but um, <coughs> but good and I just took a nap and it is lunchtime now. So we're going to see if there's a place called, I think it's called Karua Brewery. I think that's what it's called. It's that way. <laughs> Down for Tricker Road. More or less almost just before you enter the town, but we're going to see now and it's quite humid today. For some reason, but I'm am not complaining. But yeah, let's go. for the entire weekend if you are not planning on say self catering and want to like prep food for yourself so just keep that in mind so I guess we're back oh there's it back that way so I got myself some chicken wings with chips and Courtney got a beef burger So to end the night off, we got pizza, a pizza, at the Philippolis restaurant um, because mm. we just didn't feel like going out because uh, we went out all day. So yeah, that's what we're eating. And we are officially leaving Philippolis this morning. It is very humid today, <laughs> as you can tell. Packing the car already and it was very very nice this town is 
incredibly quiet if that is the type of relaxation or getaway vacation that you're looking for where it's peaceful the church bells rings the church is actually in service today um you can hear as well the birds chirping and it's you just hear the wind of the trees blowing very very nice um so yeah i am incredibly grateful that i was able to visit and explore polo polos for all it's worth and i will see you in the next small door <laughs> bye guys